Hello, hello, welcome back to my YouTube channel, World of Tradec. This is my first time reviewing a commercial aircraft, I think. Yes, uh, especially from Minicraft model kits. This is um, apparently, apparently, this is the Delta 737 400 version. I mean, Delta Airlines, that's a livery. But um, it is uh, the Boeing 737-400 version. But um, I think I will prove it. Uh, this is not the 400. This is the 300 version. In one 144th scale. And, um, well, this is the... Um, the cover of the box, the main box. It's a medium box, <coughs> a little bit strong. Uh, this is the signature of the um, painter or the the render, the artist. I cannot read it. It's a uh, kind of wallow. W a l o. I'm not sure. It's it's uh, very hard to understand it. Anyway, um, I mentioned it. No problem. Well, that's the main cover. Uh, let me explain you uh, about the sights. The same cover. Um, some warnings, as always, and not suitable for children under 36 months of age because of small parts. Copyright 2001, Minicraft Model Inc. with the US address. The England address, made in China, the barcode. And the Imma, I, or oh, I'm, I'm not sure how to pronounce it, but it is uh, I M A M M A. Uh, the meaning of this is uh, International Model Hobby Manufacturers Association. I uh, found like uh, International Motorcycle Motorcycle uh, Manufacturers Association. I'm not sure which one is the correct one, but I think this is uh, the correct one. Okay, um, <coughs> this is oh, these are the explanation in six languages. Uh, among them, English, Spanish, uh, German, um, maybe in, Fran in French, and uh, Portuguese. Well, Minicraft catalog number uh, for the in order to search it on the catalog 14506 skill level 2 one, 144 skill delta 737 400 or maybe uh, this is the uh, the airline boeing 737 400 and this is the short history of the delta airlines and the boeing 737 with this uh, model kit already built by a professional modeler well that's it nothing no big deal at the back let's open the box the model is already built you will see it let's start with the building instructions I um, counted the pieces 47 pieces the dimensions 22.5 centimeters long by 20 centimeters wingspan Okay, as I told you, Delta Airlines, Boeing 737-300, not the 400, because the 400 is a little bit longer, the fuselage. Well, a uh, short history of the aircraft, let's check the rest of the building instructions from Minicraft. Step number one, add the um, weight nose with uh, a half ons very simple nothing inside the two sides of the fuselage um, this part of the landing gear maybe the uh, wheel well mm, step number two engine assembling two ones uh, each side. Uh, this one is for the left and this one is for the right side. 
assembling the wing, the main wings and the engines, main wing and the engines, uh, some little parts under the wings, the starboard. Main assembly, the main wings uh, to the fuselage, the cockpit, uh, part of the fuselage, part of the windscreen, uh, we have to, but I didn't, to fill and sand. I will prove it uh, with the model. These um, horizontal stabilizers in one solid mold. Um, the landing gear system, struts, etc. The front landing gear and the markings for the Delta Airlines. But unfortunately, the water stickers of this uh, livery um, didn't uh, bring it on the model kit. Unfortunately, I had to use another um, livery, a Polish Airlines LOT instead. So I, ha I really solved the problem. Well, uh, paint colors, uh, bottom view with the um, silver. Uh, paintings, etc., the details about the, the fans of the engine, etc. Well, that's it about the building instructions. I really wanted to, to make the Avior, Avior Venezuelan, Avior um, airline and for the Venezolana Airlines with this uh, water stickers delivery for the, that uh, uh, airline, but um, uh, it, it was not suitable for that uh, Boeing 737 because it is for the 737-400 for Avior and this one is for the 737-200 not suitable because of the size remaining sprues empty sprues because the model is already built and the remaining water stickers for the LOT airline the Polish Airlines Boeing 737-400 but I had to modify the dimension because of the model kit is the 300 version LOT logo for maybe the display stand more ahead and this is the view about the, the guide how to apply the water stickers on the fuselage and the tail etc and the engines well the um, i used this uh, display stand from skymax models this is not for uh, minicraft i used it because i i had it and i really need to use it Okay, this is the embossed brand, uh, right here, the, the, non, the name, Skymax models. That's not uh, shiny, that's uh, matte, matte finishing. And this is the aircraft, already built with the uh, Polish Airlines livery. I had to modify the water stickers, the original water stickers, because this aircraft uses only one um, emergency exit, not two. Um, well, that's, uh, I didn't um, prime it, I painted it directly to the plastic. I didn't fill the seams. As, as you see, uh, uh, the seams are not hidden because they are not filled and sand. Uh, only sand it but um, the paint got inside the, 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 the seams so that's very bad anyway but it, it was built uh, around uh, maybe seven years ago I was experimenting new um, techniques and uh, about the cockpit um, I polished it directly I didn't uh, apply any a clear coat so I polished it in the 
two months later, um, some cracks appeared on the surface. So that was so PT PT experience. But um, I really like the the result anyway. Uh, the other problem I had is uh, I placed the window strip in the middle of this uh, high. Uh, this height uh, it should be placed a little bit uh, higher, a little bit higher, not in the middle. So well, that was uh, for the beginner uh, any problems for the a lot of problem for the beginners like uh, I was uh, <clears throat> trying seven years ago anyway but it was I, I will give um, a, a score of um, 8 of 10 unfortunately let's check the side uh, sighting from nose to tail the dihedral angles are very good uh, some problems about this um, warped wing. Uh, I didn't uh, fix it. I really like the wheels. The, um, sorry, the um, the wings. They are. Uh, I really like it. Uh, These uh, aluminium zones. No um, emergency uh, steps included on these uh, water stickers the logo on the tail i really like it i really like the, um, the tail uh, the wing tail and um, i opened this uh, hole this uh, square hole for the um, display stand i will show you some problems about the 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 seams on the um, engines. No, I didn't uh, fill it and I didn't sand it. Um, this is uh, for the Polish registration. It's uh, let me check the letters. It's uh, Sierra Papa Lima Lima Lima. Okay. Um, well how to apply the display stand on it look at this design it's uh, this is for this uh, part and this one is for this I didn't glue it it is just placed okay I put it right here I hope it is not going to to get it wrong that's nice. I really like uh, this position. This angle is right to me. It's very fine. Well, um, inside it's the um, the weight, the weight nose, in order to place it uh, on the ground and avoiding the tail drop, the drop tail. I don't know how to say it, but uh, that's fine. I really like it anyway. Uh, I'm sorry for the mistake for the beginner. Beginner. Um, well, that's it about. Oh, let me check. Let me explain you something about the stickers for another airline. But I will use it if I buy another Boeing 737. It is. It is from the Avior of your airline but um, I don't like uh, the yellow at yellow to A but I will restore it by exposing it on the, with the sunlight well anyway that's it for now this is the review about this uh, minicraft model kit the Boeing 737-300 not the 400 okay and without this livery i used the lot polish airlines thank you very much for watching this review and let's go on to the next one bye bye